Welcome to Keep Fit with Kim. I'm Kim and today we have a 20 minutes aerobics workout. We're going to start with a gentle warm up. So just marching through. It's small to start with. And again. Taking it to an easy walk. That's two forward, two back. So take it forward and back. A little bit wider at the front, narrow at the back. Touch to your right. Add some side arms, just keep it small for now. Take you back to the march. A little bit bigger now. Arms. Well done. Easy walk. Take it forward and back. And again. Keep breathing. That side step. Now think about pulling in your abs, so pulling your belly button back against your spine. Your feet ideally should be pointing forward. Try and keep your head up. Let's add on a kick back. So keeping those feet wide and kick your bottom. Legs are wide. Easy walk. See if you can start to sink slightly into that forward walk. Side step and clap. Keep it wide. We're going to take it up a bit. The music gets a little bit faster now. So just get the beat. Right, left, right, left. Take it to that easy walk. So forward and back. Try and dip down as you come forward. Side step. Now try and get these arms up to shoulder height now, so a little bit higher. We're going to kick back. Four, three, you do four on the right. The one, two, three. Change. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Take it to twos. So two right, two left. Back to a march. Keep it on the right foot. Easy walk. Side step. This time we're going to give a clap and a little jump if you wish. If you don't, 
keep it small. Two to the right, so shift and back. Four, keep it small. So the feet are pointing the direction of moving. Do those kickbacks, legs are wide. Four more like this. Four on the right. Four, three, two, one, four, three. Change the arms. Push. Twos. March it through. This time we're starting on the left foot. So we're going to do it all in the other direction. Easy walk. Side step and up. Keep it small if that's too much for you. Two to the left. walk side step keep the arms low for now just catch your breath a moment ready for knee lift single To make it harder you can lift those legs a little higher you can add a bit of a hop if you wish for now I'm going to keep it low to each side two march it through so we're starting on the left so left right left right Four, three, easy walk. Change lead leg, out. Right left. Step touch. Knee lifts. Singles. So you can keep that arm lower if you wish. Take it high. Pop if you wish. That's four, three, two each side. One, two, one, two. So if it's getting too much for you, take the arm smaller. Four, three, two, and change. Four, three, two, and change. Four, three, two. Last time for four, three, two. Take that leg out to the side. Out and in, out this foot stays still, 
change sides, so touching out and in, so a little lunge to the side, shift your weight into that leg, speed that up, other side, for four, three, two, one, other side, four, three, two, two each side, two, other side, and twos, two to the side, up the side, singles, and an arm, march it through. Change the lead leg. Don't worry too much if you haven't managed to do that, just keep moving. Side steps this way. Not much longer now, try and keep moving. Just make the movement smaller if it's too easy. You can make them harder. Knee lift. So again, if it's too hard, keep it small. If it's too easy, add a hop. I'm going to stay somewhere in the middle. To each side. Two. Two. Four each side. Four. Three. Two. Four. Three. Two. Same leg goes out to the side. Side. Do singles. Keep facing the front, I'm going to turn sideways for the next one, for four, three, two, taking that leg behind, arms in front. Really try and tilt the pelvis under, keep that belly button cool to the spine. If that's too much, just keep it small. You can do it half time if you need to. If you're struggling with your breath here, take it lower. Leave the arms out if it's too much. Last four, three, two, marching on the spot. Just catch your breath if you need to. Remember, anytime you need to stop and get a glass of water, grab your water do, but try and keep those feet moving. Box step, easy walk. Try and sink into it a little bit lower now. Side step. Let's take those arms up higher now. And change the arms. Elbows high. Stay facing the front for now. We're not going to change direction yet. Just walk it through. Well done. That's the hard part over. Take a deep breath. March it through. to bring our heart rate back down, cool the body down. Step tap, keep those arms smaller now. down if you really are struggling with your breath at the moment don't worry it'll get easier four three two march it through four three Let's 
change the lead left to the left. Tap and change, tap. Well done. We're on the home run now. So the first time doing this for a long time, it's going to be hard work. If you've been doing exercise for a long time, you might find this quite easy. We're going to step tap to the left. Let those arms swing softly. Two steps for the clap. Well done. Okay, let's just do a couple of stretches. Finish off. I'm gonna get you to stand upright. Take the right foot behind you. Press that heel on the floor. And we're straightening that back leg. Both feet are pointing forward. So have a quick look down. I've got a band down the middle of my mat so I can see quite nicely. If you're struggling with your balance, take your, wee, wee, your feet even wider apart that way. Front knee's bent and above the ankle. If you find it shooting out over the knee, take that leg forward. And you should be feeling the stretch in the calf muscle here. So just pushing that heel down. Stay with that leg position. I'm gonna turn so you can see what I'm doing. I'm gonna ask you to take your left hand onto your right shoulder. Just let it slide. You should push it back and stretch through that shoulder. And if you want, you can just do a slight turn through the body. Twisting at the waist, keeping that back foot pointing forward. Let's change legs. So start off by taking the left leg back. Knees above the ankle, both feet are pointing forward. Think of leaning forward. We're looking for a straight line from the head through to that ankle, leaning on the leg. Taking the right hand onto the shoulder. pushing back. If you want to add a little twist you can. Okay, a little bit of balance here. You can grab hold of the wall if you wish. Taking the right foot into your hand and just push that hip forward. You're going to feel the stretch through the hip flexor across the hip here and through the thigh. So if you need to hold the wall or a bookcase do, if you can balance even better. Try and keep those knees together and push the hand into the foot. Well done. I'm going to take it to your left leg. So don't worry if you're on the wrong leg to start with. As long as you do both legs, it doesn't matter. And again, you can hold the wall, hold a bookcase. Have a deep breath in and release. Well done. Hope to see you tomorrow.